Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix automatic scrolling on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. Now the first step is to restart your computer. So go to the start menu, click on the power icon, then click on restart. After the system restart, it should go ahead and fix the problem. For many users, restarting the PC has fixed the problem. So restart your computer. The next step is to turn off this option. So for this, type in mouse settings in Windows search box and then click on mouse settings. Now over here you will find this option which says scroll in active windows when hovering over them. So if this option is on, turn it off and then check. Now the next step is to check if shift and tab keys are stuck on your keyboard. So on your keyboard, it if shift and tab is stuck, then you might face this problem. So make sure shift and tab is not stuck i'm not pressing tab because it will scroll so if these two keys are stuck it will cause the problem so make sure that is this two keys are not stuck also if you're using external mouse and keyboard unplug the external mouse and keyboard and plug it to a different usb port on your computer and then check now the next step is to if you have a wired or wireless game controller connected to the computer then unplug it or disconnect the bluetooth in your Windows computer and that should go ahead and fix the problem. Now this is the common cause. So if you have the wired controller connected to the computer, then disconnect the wire cable. Now if you have a wireless game controller connected, in that case you can disconnect the Bluetooth, you can disconnect your controller or you can turn off the Bluetooth and then check. So that should go ahead and fix the automatic scrolling. Now the next step is to change the battery. If you have wireless mouse connected to the computer, so you can go ahead and change the battery and check. This has also worked for many users, so it might work for you. Now the next step is to run SFC and DSM command. For this type in CMD in Windows search box. Make a right click on command prompt app, then click on run as administrator. Click on yes to allow. Now paste the first command. This command is provided in the video description. Paste it, hit the enter key, and let the scan complete. Now once the scan is 100% complete, run the second scan. So this time, once the first scan is complete, copy this command and then paste it on the same window and then hit the enter key. And once the second scan is 100% complete, restart the computer and then check. Now the next step is to update your windows to the latest version. For this, go to the start menu and then click on settings. Go to windows update or update and security and then click on check for updates. Once all the updates are installed, restart the computer and then check. Now the next step is to uninstall and uninstall recently installed update. So on your Windows computer, if you have recently installed update and that is causing the problem. So after updating your Windows, if you're facing this problem, then open Windows settings, then go to update and security or Windows update, then go to update history and then scroll down in Windows 10 on the very top, you will see uninstall update, click on it. In Windows 11, scroll down, then click on uninstall update. Now select the latest update which is installed and then click on uninstall. After the uninstall, restart your computer and then check. Now the next step is to uninstall and reinstall your mouse and keyboard from device manager. So make a right click on the start menu and then click on device manager and then expand keyboards. Make a right click, then click on uninstall device, then click on uninstall. Now expand mice and other pointing devices. Make a right click on your mouse and then click on uninstall, uninstall. Now after the uninstall, restart your computer. Now when you restart your computer, during the system restart, your keyboard and mouse will install the default driver and that should go ahead and fix the problem. Now the last step is to connect external keyboard and mouse. So if you have any additional extra keyboard and mouse, you can go ahead and connect external keyboard and mouse. That is the other one. You can go ahead and try if you have any extra keyboard and mouse and then check if the scrolling stops that means something is wrong with the keyboard or mouse so try to figure it out which one is wrong and then you can replace it or you can contact your system uh, keyboard or mouse manufacturer to get it replaced so one of the steps should help you to fix the automatic scrolling on your windows 10 or 11 computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel